Well, howdy guys, a bit of a different video here. It's about beavers. Hey, nice beaver. Now, you might be in a country that has beavers. I know in the UK, the only beavers there are up in Scotland. But in Canada and lots of places in America, there's loads of beavers, of course. And I like a beaver. <laughs> of course I do. But beavers are good, hardworking. But they do do just one thing and that is build a dam. And whereas in the middle of the forest and everything, it can create a lot of diversity. They also can destroy land as well, farmland. They can flood it. And they can flood main roads as well. And I know where I lived in Canada, lots of times we had to take the dam down, but the beavers would just build it back up again. So they had to be gotten rid of. Because whereas beavers do a good thing in the forest, too many beavers are not good for the forest either. But you got these do-gooder environmentalists, or really they're activists. Most of them are women. And if they're men, they just don't understand about nature in the first place. Then, as I said before about femons, they only know one thing about nature. Flowers are pretty and don't kill the animals. But the environmentalists up in Scotland have got really angry because licenses have been issued to farmers to kill the beaver. Because the beaver is flooding their farmland. But it's typical in the UK, you get these femons, usually, and there's one in the news item here, that has absolutely no understanding of nature or ecological systems at all. And it kind of reminds me of the stupidity of the seagulls on the south coast in the UK, where there's so many of them, they are just a pest and should be culled. Then I remember there was lots of times I used to go duck hunting and come across beavers swimming by or whatever, and I used to enjoy watching them. But it's like anything in nature, there has to be a balance. And I do wish these environmentalists or these activists, mostly femons, would read some books about the ecological system anyway and nature, and try and fully understand it before they open their mouths. And, of course, the best people that have ever been for environmentalists and for nature have always been usually hunters. Why? Because they understand nature. And they also love nature, too. Anyway, guys, let me know what you think about this and what you think about licenses to kill the beaver. But really, guys, eh? Nature is all about balance. And it sounds like the beaver up in Scotland is out of balance. There's too many of them. Just a quick one there, guys. I'm kind of off the mark on the MGTOW, but kind of. It's there, right? You take it easy now.